So in front of me I had something called water beans or gel beans I believe. Uh, you put them overnight in water, they are very small in the beginning uh, and then they become squishy like this. And uh, I'm gonna test out if they can help keep the moisture in my house plants while we are away for vacation for a week. So I am in Sweden and it's summer even though it doesn't show because Sweden summer you have uh, a lot of different weather. Uh, it's between 16 degrees Celsius to up to 28 degrees Celsius. Uh, but uh, so today is rainy but I expect the weather to be a little bit better during the week so in front of me I have two house plants that I have on my balcony it's a Carolina Reaper and an uh, Academia fruit tree so uh, basically uh, what I will test out is to place beads on top of the soil after I've watered it and Hopefully this will help keep the moisture in the in the pot in the plants and uh, these two white Devices that you see here they are hooked up to a system that I built where I can measure the moisture and nutrition and, and so on in my plants, so uh, Hopefully this will give us a more scientific test So all you do is you place it like this and I believe these are not poisonous or anything like that. They are bio, bio degradable or whatever it's called. Uh, let's see here. So I will also be, be doing this for my indoor plants uh, that are next to the windows. Uh, we'll cover that as well very soon. So I will not put too much, but still at least covering the top layer. So these beans, you can buy them basically on eBay and so on. And uh, <laughs> let's see how this works out. So one week has passed and we went on vacation, so let's check on how the water beans have held up. So the Carolina Reaper, I have received some notices that it is thirsty, but it is not too bad actually. The jelly beans, these are wet, but it has rained a couple of days outside. The Academia seems fine. However, if we look at the paprika, that looks really bad. This really needs water to be saved. And then we have the dragon fruit. As you can see, the ones inside, the balls has shrinked. They're still squishy, but yeah, dried up. Here's the other plants. Not dead, thirsty, but... And this one is a Mediterranean tree, so it's not really affected, even though the balls have shrinked. So I'm curious if, on how it recovers after some water. That's my daughter in the background. Well, this doesn't need water, however, this needs water. So, what is the verdict? Um, I mean, let's look at the numbers. But, I would say, not perfect, but not too bad. Oh, 
I noticed that the Carolina Reaper has bloomed. So that is not bad. Cool. So what have we learned? Does jelly water beans work? I mean the paprika has some peppers. Yeah, some are dried up, but I just water it. So let's give it an hour or so, see how it looks. Do I recommend this? Sure, why not? It's not perfect. But if you're gonna be away for a couple of days and you have no one that can water your plants then I would say go ahead There we go, one hour later, almost fully recovered. So, hope you enjoyed this video.